Well, hello everybody. Today I wanted to answer a question that I got on Instagram and this person was wondering how I am able to stick to a raw diet during times of stress, when I'm tired, when I'm bored, and what I did in the early days to stick to raw and how I was able to build those habits. So I wanna talk about some things that really helped me in the early days to deal with those stressful situations because we all go through them. We all go through crazy things. Life throws some interesting sh stuff <laughs> um, our way, but I want to share a little bit about how I am able to stick to my raw diet during those stressful times. Like I was raw during my divorce. I was raw um, when my 20 year companion kitty cat passed away. I was raw during a big breakup. I, I was raw through it all. Hello everybody. Um, and I want to share some things that really helped me through it because I feel like that's probably one of the reasons why people fall off, not just that they're not eating enough or the peer pressure or all of that stuff, but also because of stress, stress and stressful situations make us feel overwhelmed and tired and we just wanna eat whatever because it's just easy or convenient or comforting or whatever it is. So today I wanna go through that, but first, but first, but first, but first, but first, I'm going to post in the chat here. If you want to get the plant-based bundle, comment the word epic and I'll send you a link. The link is also in my bio, so Feel free to leave the live, go buy the bundle, and then come back to the live because there's only two days left to get the bundle. Only two days left and it's over. So if you wanna get over $3,700 worth of content for $50, go now and get that. So just type the word epic, I'll send you a list of all the things that we've com contributed to this bundle. We've contributed a lot of things. I'm just gonna pull up right now a list of everything that we have contributed to this bundle. I don't know where that list is not showing up here. Um, so I'm just gonna go off the top of my head. Okay, so we contributed. You get all of this, all of this for $50. You get the hand salads wrap ebook, the taco ebook, the Party Food Appetizer ebook, Meal Plan Volume 3, A Live Lunch, which is our 35 hour video course. That alone is worth $330. Nate's Microgreens video course, his Kitchen Essentials video course, his Nice Cream book, his Dude Food book, um, the Wholesome Scoops Ninja Creamy book. I've got Holiday Menu 1, 2, and 3 in there, as well as Make It Raw Volume 2 that I wrote with Chef AJ. And there's two more, Checkmate Your Cravings is in there. And I believe there's another one, just, I just can't remember it off the top of my head. That's how many things that we have in this bundle. Total value, if you were to buy all of those separately from our website, it would be regular retail $867. Even with the 60% off, there's no way you're getting all that content for 50 bucks. No way at all. So if you want, this is your chance. Two days left to get the bundle. Link is in my bio, link is in the description box, or type the word epic if you're watching here on Instagram, and I will post the link. But get it now because it ends December 2nd, 2024 at midnight New York time, and then it's gone. If you already got the bundle or you want to just get our eBooks on the side, December 2nd is the last day to get the 60% off our eBooks. That code is BFF. 2024 and just send me a direct message and I'll get you the link or you can go to payhip.com slash raw food romance to get the ebook store and yeah use that code BFF 2024 and you will get 60% off our ebooks so that sales going on right now I have so many Black Friday deals like the Excalibur dehydrators are on sale right now. Osea Malibu, the skincare um, that I absolutely love is on sale right now. Morocco Method, if you want to link to any of the products, Morocco Method is hair care. Um, it really makes Nate's curls extra awesome. So we've really been loving that hair care line. It's raw and vegan. So send me a direct message and I'll get you the link to anything that you want. 
uh, I'm happy to do that. But if you want the link for the bundle, type the word EPIC and that will automatically send to you. So you'll be able to um, go to that link or just leave the live and go to the link in my bio uh, or in the description if you're watching on YouTube. Okay, let's get into it. Um, enough about all of that. I just wanted to say it. I know I'm being annoying with it because this is such an amazing deal. I just don't want anyone to miss out because inevitably on Tuesday, I'm going to get so many people saying, oh, I didn't buy it. I missed it. The weekend went by so fast and I wasn't able to get it. But unfortunately, the bundle organizers don't extend it past the deadline. So get it now before the weekend disappears and you won't be able to get it anymore. So type the word epic, go to the link in my bio, get the bundle. $50 gets you so much content. Um, there is a lot of raw food stuff in there. Like, like I said, there's 16 things from us. So there's plenty um, for you. So why do I feel like I've been able to stay raw through the challenges? Like I said, I went through a divorce. I went through my companion pet passing away. I went through a really big breakup. Um, Nate's parents passing away last year. Um, and just like moving to another country and the stress of the immigration and you know, stress from taxes, stress from daily life. Like there's so many things that happen, not just the big events, but you know, daily little things that can be stressful. How do I stay raw through it? And how did I do it at the beginning? Number one, I focus on my why. Why am I choosing raw? Why am I making these choices? I always go back to my why. I'm vegan for the animals and I'm raw for my health. I choose raw because I love raw. I don't choose it because I have to. I don't, don't choose it because I'm scared of cooked food. I don't choose it because I think cooked food is poisonous and toxic and all this stuff. I choose raw because I feel amazing eating raw food. So that's why I love doing raw food. And I just go through my why. I go through how I feel. I go through what is it that I want from my life. And the second thing that I do is I think of my future self. So while I'm going through something super stressful, I think what is future Lissa going to wish that present Lissa did? Is she going to look back and be like, yeah, I wish I would have eaten healthy during that stressful time. It would have been a real help. Like I probably wouldn't have felt so crappy. Um, I probably would have been able to support my body through it because stress is very stressful. Our bodies need extra tender, loving care when we are going through stressful situations. So it's really important to support our bodies through it instead of giving our bodies, you know, this easy, convenient food that, isn't going to help us in the long run. So that's something that I did in the early days as well as I would think about how I will feel after I'm on the other side of the stress. Like when I start to feel good, you know, cause a lot of times I would say like, well, you know, when, when I'm in my new place after this divorce, then I will, um, eat healthy or what have you. But I didn't do that. I thought it for sure because it was stressful and I was moving out on my own for the very first time. I was getting divorced and this was in 2016. So I'd already been raw for like a year and a half or so. And I made a commitment to myself because I'm like, once I moved into my place and once I'm feeling good, what is that Lissa going to wish that I did today during the stress? What is she going to wish that I did? Is she going to wish that I stuck with raw food? Of course. So that was a big thing that kept me going raw and choosing raw during that time was thinking of my future self and what that person would want this person to do. And that made it a lot easier because I'd be like, yeah, that person's going to, going to wish that I, that I made that big smoothie and that I had that big salad. So that really helped. Um, the third thing that I would do is I would focus on how I felt. This was really big because we all know how we feel when we eat those convenience foods and it's just not as great. So I would focus on how I felt. I, I felt better eating raw. So I'd be like, okay, I know you might want this because you're stressful or you need this because it's convenient or you don't want to make your food because you're sad or whatever it was. I would say just, you're going to feel so much better. If you choose the smoothie, you're going to feel so much better, uh, not just physically, but about myself as well. I would feel so much better about my choices moving through these stressful times, um, by making a better choice. So I would focus on how I'd feel. I'd also focus on fueling up. That's a big 
big, big, big reason why a lot of people do go back to eating convenience foods or other foods that aren't supportive to their um, goals. And it was just really hard to eat enough when you're stressed out. And I would take moments to calm down and just breathe before eating. That really helped with digestion as well. Um, but eating enough was super key for me during those periods of times. There were some moments where I was so sad or so like angry or stressed or whatever it was that I wasn't really able to eat. Um, but you know, once I would calm down, then I would be able to get something in. But when we are running on empty, then the cravings come full blast and it's really hard to make better decisions when we are hungry. So taking a moment to step back and even though I wasn't feeling hungry to eat something anyways, because I knew I needed to support my body. And again, thinking of my future self, what is my future self going to wish that I did? Um, next would be, um, just reading off a list here. So I didn't forget anything for you. Knowing that when I choose healthy during hard times, it gets easier in general. So I made a YouTube video talking about um, embracing the challenge and practicing our new habits in the challenging times is so beneficial to us because if we don't practice during the challenging times, how are we gonna get good at choosing healthy during challenging times if we don't actually practice it during the challenging times? So I would take it as a challenge. When I was stressed or tired or angry or whatever it was, I would take a moment. You always wanna take a moment and just take a step back and be like, this is a challenge. I want to practice making these healthy choices during the challenging times because it's so easy during you know, the happy times. Um, it's a lot easier to choose raw because it becomes a habit and you get used to choosing those things during the challenging times. So you know what you need to do during the challenging times to make those healthy choices. You will learn how you need to plan, how you need to prepare, um, what you need to think about, how you need to feel. You do all of that during the challenging time so it can get you through for number one, but it also solidifies solidifies and builds that habit during the challenging times. It's so important to practice that. Um, so that's something that I would do. I would just remind myself that if I choose healthy today, even though I'm stressed out and tired and angry, I know that it's going to help solidify this habit that I'm trying to build. So that would help. Um, Truly Tiffany is asking in the chat, can you save this live? This live will, all the lives that I do are always saved on my Reels tab on Instagram. This live is actually also going up on YouTube. So it'll be up on YouTube later today. So if you wanna rewatch it, you're welcome to. And before we continue, don't forget to get the bundle. There's only two days left to get the bundle. You're getting, over $3,700 worth of content for 50 bucks. The link is in my bio. And you can also tap the word or type the word epic in the chat on Instagram here and I will send you a link um, on YouTube. Link is in the description box. So yes, that bundle is over in two days. We have contributed 16 things to this bundle. Total value of the stuff we contributed is $867, but you get to download all of it all of the things that we contributed for 50 bucks. So that's it. You just pay $50 and you get a huge download list and you can download all of the content that you want. It's an amazing deal, but it ends December 2nd on Monday at midnight New York time. So get it now before it's gone. Um, then, okay, following along with other things that helped me through stressful times, I would just go through the motions. Now, when you're stressed out, you don't want to get in the kitchen and make a salad. You don't want to make that smoothie. You just want to grab something easy to go or whatever it is. But what I would tell myself is I, I would say, just go in the kitchen. Just do one thing at a time. Choose something small and just do that. It would be even as small as just take the knife and cutting board out. Once that came out, I would say to myself, all you have to do is chop the lettuce. That's all you have to do right now. Just chop the lettuce. Because when we're stressed out, we're overwhelmed by everything. And the thought of making a big variety salad or even a smoothie can feel super overwhelming um, to us. So just start with small things, just one step at a time, one ingredient at a time, one line of a recipe at a time. And just slow down, instead of seeing everything all at once, just do one thing at a time. So I would say, just chop the lettuce. 
That's all you need to do right now. So I chopped the lettuce and then I'd be like, okay, now, now you can just chop the tomatoes. All you have to do is think about is chop the tomatoes. That's all you have to do. And then by the time I got through that, I was on a roll and I was in a different mindset and I'd be like, okay, now I'm going to add this. I'm going to add that. And it was so much easier to make a salad once I got into the kitchen and actually started the chopping. It was so much easier um, to do that. So that is another thing that really helped me and it can help a lot of people who are feeling overwhelmed, especially if you get the bundle, there's like I said, over a hundred downloads. There's thousands of recipes in the bundle. You're getting over 500 recipes from us for 50 bucks along with everything else. So get it now, link in bio, link in description, type the word epic. Um, but with everything, it can be really overwhelming and some people feel like, oh my gosh, there's so much or the recipe's so long or whatever. Just go line by line. Just open one book at a time and, and read through it. Get cozy on the couch and read through one ebook. Screenshot a recipe that you might wanna make tomorrow and do it one thing at a time. That really, really helps with overwhelm in anything, learning a new language. Instead of feeling like you have to learn the whole language in a day, start with one word and practice that one word. That's all you need to do. And then the next day, you practice that one word and add a new word and you just practice that word all day. And over time, you get better at it. And the same with our diet, the more we do it, the better we get at it. So take your time, slow it down, one line at a time can really help if you're feeling overwhelmed, especially during stressful times. Um, and that goes into the types of foods that I would choose um, during stressful times would be my fallback five. So I like to call the fallback five, the top five recipes that are easy to make, you always have ingredients on hand, and you enjoy. So these are five recipes that are raw and vegan or whatever diet you're trying to stick to, just vegan or whatever it is. Choose those five recipes that you know you're gonna like, even when you're stressed out and you want a pizza takeout or whatever. You always have the ingredients on hand, so you can make it anytime, anywhere really, <laughs> if you take the ingredients with you. Um, and it's just easy to make. So one of the ones that helped me through my first year raw was my French dressing. And that dressing is super easy to make. It's five dates, the juice of one lemon, two cloves of garlic, a little bit of apple cider vinegar, <laughs> and uh, a half a teaspoon of smoked paprika. Now you could add like a teaspoon of chia seeds to that if you wanted to boost up your omega-3 essential fatty acids you could do that but blend that up with about a cup of water and pour that on a big giant salad with lettuce tomatoes cucumbers bell peppers um, other lettuces other greens sprouts microgreens whatever you want to add to that salad it's a really light nice dressing and i always have dates I always have lemons, I always have garlic, I always have smoked paprika, I always have apple cider vinegar, so I can make that salad dressing anytime. And I ate that pretty much every single day for the first year that I was vegan or more. And I still, we still eat that so often. Many times we'll just be tired or stressed from a day or like during tax season, we're just like, oh, let's just make a French dressing. It's gonna be so easy. It's so easy. So when you have your fallback five, get out a piece of paper, and write down your favorite five recipes. If you don't know those yet, get the bundle because you're getting hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of recipes for 50 bucks. Um, so get the bundle so you can download all of those and find five recipes. You're gonna need to work through some and try some and see how you like it. And when you find a favorite, write it down. And these become your fallback five. Once you get your fallback five, then you know what you can default to when you are stressed, when you are tired, when you don't want to make food. You can just look at your list and be like, oh yeah, I know, I like all of those and they're pretty easy to make and I have all the ingredients. So then you go back to that previous step where you just go in the kitchen. Um, Zara is asking, is that recipe in your dressings book? I forgot it all already. Oh yes. Yeah. Uh, so it's that recipe is in dips and dressings, that ebook. It's not in the bundle. Um, but there is a French style dressing in meal plan volume three. That's the one I forgot. Um, that's in the bundle. So you can download meal plan volume three when you buy the bundle and that e recipe book has 90 recipes. Um, 30 breakfasts, 
30 lunches and 30 dinners. And there's a lot of low fat dressings in there, including I believe a twist on the French dressing. So that's in there too. Um, there's so many options like in the meal plan volume three, some of my favorite fallback recipes would be like the Moroccan lime lunch dressing. There's a sweet maple mustard. There's divine lime, which we make a ridiculous amount of times. Um, that's in meal plan volume three as well. But the hand salads wrap book has a bunch of sauces. Um, party food has like the field fresh ranch, which is really great. Um, Queen Elizabeth, uh, says dates, apple cider vinegar, garlic, lemons. Yes. Okay. I'll share it again. I'll share it again a little slower here, um, but it, this video is going up on YouTube. So if you miss it, um, you can go watch it on YouTube after, but five pitted medjool dates, the juice of one lemon, two cloves of garlic, a little bit of apple cider vinegar, maybe like a tablespoon or so, and half a teaspoon of smoked paprika with a cup of water. And that's it. You just blend those up. If you want, you can add like a teaspoon or so of um, chia seeds. If you want to get that the omega threes in there as well, you can definitely do that. So that's that recipe. Um, it's so good, so easy, but other easy things that you can make when you're stressed out are smoothies. You can just cut up fruit. You can make simple salads. Um, or make the wraps. The wraps are so amazing. I mean, like, whoo, if it only takes like 15 minutes to make two wraps and two of the 14 by 14 wraps makes four meals, four lunches out of one recipe that only takes 15 minutes. And I'm going to be making wraps tonight because we're going hiking tomorrow. Actually, we're not going hiking tomorrow. We changed our plans because there's only two days left of the bundle. So I want to go live again tomorrow. <laughs> um, so we decided not to do our hike tomorrow just because the bundle's going on right now. And this is like the biggest sale of the year. So link is in my bio in the description box or type the word Epic in the chat and I'll send you the link and, and I'll send you a list of all the things that you get from us as well. There's 16 contributions and you just pay 50 bucks and you get to download it all. It's like seriously so amazing. I wish I had something like this when I first went raw, like seriously. <laughs> um, all right. The next thing that I did uh, during stressful times to stay raw was I would shift how I viewed treats and comforts. So most of the time in my past, I would think, oh, I'm so stressed out. I deserve this treat. I switched how I viewed a treat. A treat to me now is something I do to support my body through stress. That's a treat for my body. So now when I feel like I deserve a treat, I shift and I think I deserve something that supports my body, which is a treat. So what I do is I make my big salad and I watch a comforting movie or I call a friend or maybe I play a phone game or whatever it is that gets my mind off the situation, but I'm still fueling myself and I'm still supporting my body and I'm treating my body to health. So instead of having a comfort treat like pizza or takeout, I'm giving myself a health treat by supporting my body through the stressful time. So I don't end up feeling worse later. And that's something that is really interesting too, is that we don't really realize how our choices during stressful times will affect us when we get out of the stressful times. I don't want to look back and say, like now I, I feel crappy because I ate all that crappy food while I was feeling crappy. And I felt even more crappy because I was eating all of that stuff during the stressful times. And now that the stressful thing is over and I'm feeling better, now I have to make up for all of the, you know, like maybe I have headaches or whatever. And this is all in the past, right? Before I went raw, I would do this often. I'd go through stress and I'd eat whatever. And then I would feel like crap. And I'd be like, why did I do that? Cause like now I feel horrible and I have to start eating healthy again now. And it just went on a vicious cycle over and over and over and over and over and over again. So what I did instead was focus on how I will feel from a positive choice. So instead of thinking how I'm going to feel from a negative choice, I think of how I'm going to feel from a positive choice. How am I going to feel if I just get off my butt and go in the kitchen and make a smoothie? How am I going to feel about myself? How am I going to feel physically? How is that going to support me through my stress? Um, and then I do that and I find something comforting to do with it. Like 
take a nice hot bath with the smoothie um, on a little table by the bath or call a friend and, and munch on my salad while we're FaceTiming about my problems or whatever it is. I would fuel up and then I would find something comforting that has nothing to do with food. Find something comforting that helps me through the stress that doesn't have anything to do with the food. And that's something that most of us weren't taught how to do because whenever we would experience something stressful, our parents or our teachers or whoever it was would give us junk food to make us feel better. So then when, we, when we're adults and we're going through stressful times, we default to that because that's what we grew up being the default reaction to something stressful. So we need to retrain ourselves. And that's why I go back to that point that I said, practice the hard choices during the challenging times so that you're able to make those in the future and you shift and switch up your mindset and your habits. So you're no longer choosing takeout when you're going through a stressful time, you now default to those healthy things because you've made those choices during challenging times and you know you can do it because you, you did it, you practiced it. You didn't shy away, you didn't avoid, you didn't do any of that. You actually made those healthy choices so you're able to do that in the next um, challenging thing because life has always given us crazy stuff to deal with. So might as well practice during those challenging times so we get better at them. And because we're reward driven creatures, we always choose the immediate reward. We don't necessarily think of our future selves or think of how we're going to feel after all the time. We're always looking for the reward and the reward from a cozy pizza is so much more enticing, especially if we haven't eaten all day because we've been so stressed. It's so much more enticing to get that dense calories and, and the comfort food than it is to make a salad. But what happens is when we make the salad, we feel better about ourselves, we feel better about our bodies, we support ourselves through the stress, and we can still watch that cozy 80s movie or whatever it is on the couch snuggled up with our salad and still enjoy that coziness or we can go meditate or we can get to bed early or whatever it is that you need to do to help you get through the stressful times is knowing that your body needs support during the stressful times and that really really helped me when I was going through all kinds of crazy things and I stayed raw the whole time I didn't do any junk food or cooked vegan food or anything. I was raw the entire time, like I said, um, through the divorce, through my chai chai passing away. He was my 20 year old companion kitty. Um, moving to a new country, moving out, like what, during the divorce I moved out on my own. Um, and I've been through like random stressful things like immigration and tax season. I know that's stressful for a lot of people too and just day, the day to day grind or whatever it is that's stressful. I would always just take a moment and be like, oh, I need to support myself through this and healthy foods and going to bed early, hydrating myself, doing my meditations. This is all going to help me through the stress. And those kinds of things are the treats that you treat yourself to during those stressful times. So I hope everybody enjoyed this video. Um, I hope that you got some insights from it. I see in the chat here, Fuzzy Bunny says, hi, I've been offline a while. I'm finally getting a divorce. And you know, like if it's a good thing for you, that's amazing. I went through a, a big divorce. I was married for eight years. I was with him for 12 and that was, that was a big deal. I, you know, got with him, I moved out and we were together for most of my adult life. And so when we split, I had to move out on my own. I had to provide for myself. I had to all of the stuff and it was scary. It was very scary, but I stayed raw the whole time because I knew that my future self would be grateful that I did. And, and here I am, <laughs> you know, it's been, I think we've been divorced now like eight years. Um, and my future self is grateful to my past self for caring for my body during that time. And it was hard, it was hard, but I, that's what I wanted for myself. Uh, Peaceful Lady says, yes, you are so right, Lissa, because that's how I feel when I am eating raw foods, one of the best feelings in the world. And that's why I choose raw. I choose raw because I feel so good and I love it. I really do love it. 
I don't choose it because I'm scared of cooked food or I think it's poison or whatever it is. I choose raw because I love raw and I love how it makes me feel. I love to be creative. It's super easy to clean up. Um, I find it quite fast to make raw foods like Nate and I, um, for the meals for smoothies, lunches, and dinners, I can make all six meals, two breakfasts, two lunches, and two dinners in under an hour first thing in the morning. And our, all our food is done for the day. Blend the dressings, um, blend the smoothies, chop all the greens and everything for the salads. It's so easy. Um, and, and it's really nice to be able to slow down and prepare the food. That's another thing, a bonus tip, is when I was stressed out, I would want to zone out right? Because I, I didn't want to think about the stress or I didn't want to deal with this thing or whatever it was. Sometimes getting in the kitchen and just chopping, listening to a podcast or some affirmations or um, just listening to some music that I loved would bring me in connection with the food and that would really calm me down. And it would be a really nice time um, that I would spend with myself in the kitchen. So that was really helpful. And yes, if you guys want to get the bundle, Get the bundle now. The link is in my bio or in the description box, or you can type the word epic in the chat and I will automatically send you a link with a list of all 16 things from us that you get in the bundle. Not only are you getting those 16 things like the wrap book, um, the burger, uh, not the burger book. There's burger recipes in the Tales from the Tailgate. That's the, the last one that I forgot of the 16. There was a meal plan three and the Tales from the Tailgate. That's our raw vegan travel ebook. There's over a hundred recipes in that ebook alone. There's burgers, there's wraps, there's tacos, there's salads. Um, and Josh is asking, how do I get recipes? Recipes are in the plant-based bundle. That's the best way to get some of our recipes. You're getting 16 of our eBooks. Um, and of those 16 things, there's four video courses. There's checkmate your cravings, the microgreens video course, a live lunch, which is a 35 hour raw vegan kitchen course where we show you how we make the food, how we make the salads, how we make the tostadas or not the tostadas, the tacos, um, how we make the burgers, the sushi wraps. There's three new wrap recipes in the Tales from the Tailgate ebook. And, and that's just one out of over a hundred different things you get to download for just 50 bucks. You just pay $50 and you get a list of everything. I don't know how to get to your bio. Um, so what you do at the very top of the live here, there's my little icon. If you tap on that, um, it'll show up my, my page and just go to my Instagram page, my main Instagram page in my bio where it says like, I've been raw for blah, blah, blah. There's a link in there. That's the link to the bundle. Or if you can't find the bio, just type the word Epic in the chat and then go to your DMS and I will share with you the link in your DMS in your inbox. So you can do it that way as well if you can't find the link in, in my bio. And if you're watching on YouTube, link is in the description box. Um, so you can find it over there. But yeah, it's, thank you so much for um, joining me today. If you have any other questions, I'm here. If you have any, it's been a really fun time with this bundle. Mm. Mm. This is so good. If you're wondering what's in here, Nate made it, so I'm not completely sure exactly what he put in or how much, but it's banana, raspberry, mango, pineapple, strawberry, and lime juice with a little bit of water. That's what the smoothie is. It's one of my favorites. It's so good. Raspberry, mango, banana, lime is one of my favorite, <laughs> favorite smoothies. Um, Marsha says, thanks, Melissa. Love you, girl. I haven't seen you in a long time. Oh, it's good to see you. It's so good to see you. Um, on a side note, I have daily YouTube videos going out on my YouTube channel until the end of the year. So we're doing Vlogmas this year. That's 31 videos for the month of December. They're talking heads like this, so I share a lot of thoughts um, on YouTube and those videos will be going out daily. So go over to my YouTube channel, Lissa, Lissa's Raw Food Romance and subscribe so you can watch all of those videos. I'll also be sharing links to each video daily here on the uh, in my Instagram stories. So if you watch my stories, there will be a link to the new video that's going to be released on YouTube. I already have them all filmed. I just have to finish editing some of them, but there's going to be a daily video for you for the month of December. And speaking of December, on a side note, 
Um, we have the brand new Raw Food Romance online community. This community is amazing. There are over 300 people in the community now, and it's so supportive. If you're looking for support and you need new friends and you wanna share your salads and, and you wanna learn, we do daily posts over there and it's very intimate. I'm super active in that community and we are doing a December challenge where we're going to be sharing a new recipe every single day in the community. These are recipes that we won't be sharing until late 2025 or mid 2025. So if you want them now, join up. The community is only $47 a month. Uh, you can cancel any time. There's no sales on the community. It's just $47 a month. And when you join the community, you get access to the live classes. So we're doing five live classes in December. <laughs> we are going, oh yes, peaceful lady. I'm in the community. It's awesome. Isn't it awesome? If you want a link to the community, send me a direct message and I will send you a link to join the community. It's so amazing. The support in there is unreal. Seriously, if you are looking for friends and you want community off of social media, somewhere where everybody there is trying to add more raw foods to their diet, join up. So in December, we're going to be sharing a recipe a day and we have monthly challenges. We're also doing uh, 52 to a new you yearly challenge starting on December 31st. But the classes that we're doing in December, we've got a soup class. We're going to teach how to make the soups and prep for the soups. We're doing a burger making class. That's going to be super fun. That's next Saturday, December 7th at 11 a.m. PST. So you're going to want to join the community so you get access to watch that live with us. All the raw food classes are live. And then once the live is over, we uh, put the replay up. So if you miss the class, you can watch the replay. And one of the cool things about joining the community is not only do you get access to the live classes while you're in the community, but you get to watch all the past classes. And we've done a lot of classes since the community launched in September. We have a wrap making class, a sushi making class, tostada making class. We have a fermenting class. We have a Thanksgiving holiday menu class where we make five holiday dishes. And there's sprouting grow alongs like microgreens and sprouting grow alongs. We teach you how to bloom the rice and the freezing thawing technique. We have tons of recipes in the community and you get access to the community for $47 a month. But again, you can cancel anytime. Um, but you might not want to because there's so much fun going on in there daily. So join up. You can send me a DM or comment um, if you're on YouTube and I'll post the link, it'll be in the description box as well on YouTube. So you don't have to comment. Um, Tessa, Tessa, Tessa's in the community too. She's amazing. Everybody in the community is so awesome. I'm just so blessed to be part of such an amazing circle. Um, it's open to anyone. You do not need to be a raw vegan to join the community. You just need to have a love for raw food and a desire to make positive changes in your life. It's so amazing. Tessa says, yes, I can confirm that the raw food romance is bomb and so supportive. It really is. I love seeing how supportive everybody is. Is. So Noi is in there too. Noi's in the chat. She says, love our community. Oh, I love you too. Oh, everybody. Again, it's so amazing. I really hope that you are able to join if you can. Um, again, send me a direct message for the link or on YouTube, link in description. And before we sign off today, if there's no more questions, if you have a question, post in the chat. Um, but before we go, remember that there's only two days left to get the plant-based bundle. This is the biggest sale of the year. You're getting like 16 of our things. We have 25 eBooks right now and you're getting 16 of them for 50 bucks in this bundle, along with everything from everyone else. Like this is the best sale ever. Um, on our content. So you're going to want to get the bundle. Link is in my bio or in the description box or type the word epic in the chat and I will automatically send you a link with a list of everything that you're getting from us. Um, Truly Tiffany's asking, what do you eat for breakfast? Pretty much almost every single day is a smoothie. Um, so we make these big smoothies, usually around 600 calories um, of a smoothie for breakfast and usually it's just fruit. We just have a combination of different kinds of fruit for our smoothies or we make like a, I, I really like to make the cacao smoothie. It's just bananas, dates, um, cacao and vanilla 
Um, you could add maple to it if you wanted a little maple flavor. Um, but that's pretty much what we eat for breakfast every day, unless we make a fruit bowl or we have some melons or usually most days we get up, we have a couple pieces of fruit for like two or three or 400 cal calories. So that's like three bananas for 300 calories, or we'll have like an apple and a mango or something like we'll try to get a couple hundred calories in, then we'll go for a walk. And then when we get home, then we make our smoothie. So we usually try to eat around a thousand calories worth of fruit first thing in the morning. And then our salad for lunch is a lower fat salad. And then we usually have a salad for dinner or we're making other stuff like we're making wraps. Um, Tessa says, OMG, people get the bundle. It's an amazing deal. It really is. Truly, Tiffany got the bundle. Are you going to be like Tiffany and get the bundle? Link is in my bio or in the description box below. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, grab it now. Two days remain. That's it. And it's going to fly by like super fast. So get it now before you forget. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for joining me today for this video. I hope you enjoyed. I love you all so much. Um, join up on my YouTube channel, subscribe because we are doing a video a day for the month of December. Um, join the community for all the live raw food classes. We've got so much going on for the month of December. It's going to be a party over there. So join the up on that. And yes, thank you everybody for joining. Mwah! I love you all so much. And as always, fruit on. <laughs>